sunglasses safety yams we here and now we are going to a topic that I would not rather want wanted uh, to cover I'm not used to do like reaction material but I just thought I, I had to react to this this is so messed up so Gen Alpha is messed up really uh, the identity madness uh, from satanic influence has finally have, have like uh, come ashore in Finland and now our young ones are again alpha is thinking they're animals yeah like young kids are thinking that oh I, I'm not human being I'm an animal and I'm not a furry I'm, I'm, I'm a real animal yeah you, it would be better if they would be furries in my opinion since uh, this is really 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 harmful behavior I have like um, talked before like uh, that uh, I have been uh, like an occultist before I came Christian came to Christianity became a Christian uh, so uh, I know a thing or two about having a spirit animal and studying spirit animals mostly from Finnish sites so uh, when you are like finding your spirit animal it's not uh, really it's not so different from having a horoscope or something like that since uh, you can find based on your horoscope like like uh, um, written text maybe maybe someone talks to you or uh, you watch some video where someone talks but you can find information what kind of person you are and I'm pretty sure this um, Gen Alpha thing thinking they're animals works the same way like uh, like uh, the Satan's influence people they are like writing or telling how the, they are based on if, if this one Finnish kid thinks he's a dog they will tell uh, okay a dog person is like this and they will tell uh, like this is the common scam that uh, like uh, horoscope people have pulled off for like thousands of years I don't know how long I'm not the expert in history but uh, for a very long time at least so uh, there are actually people who believe in their horoscopes like literally they read them and they cannot live without them so um, and I think there's uh, well, let's start to call it by what it's called, this Terrian, or and the sports that they have, where they play to be animals and do sports on four feet. I mean, like a, a, a hands and feet on the ground. So the Guadro is athletics so okay let's go a little bit about this uh, this poster that these extremely young people have like uh, put on the wall it's it's firstly it's ridiculous and secondly it's dangerous and thirdly it's harmful for the psyche and for the de developer develop development of like your own personality you can tell that these are young kids
did. Uh, I will um, address a few things about this poster. So there is uh, like the first, uh, it would be like all Terrians, but uh, it has been misspelled. Kaiki is like it would be all with just one L. That kind of misspelling. And then we go and read Guadro Fulvists. So uh, what the word was supposed to be was Guadro Vists. And they are like trying to be too smart here. Like Guadro Fulvist would mean a person who has a phobia of Guadro Athletics, Olympics or whatever they call them. They're like misspelling their uh, their uh, their, um, their athletics, misspelling it as someone who is afraid of the athletics. Maybe they're all fat kids, and this is not a misspelling. They're extremely fat kids, and they are afraid of like uh, you know working out, so they wrote, actually write that they are afraid of... I am quadrophobist. I'm afraid what, uh, uh, like, maybe I should go there. <laughs> but I'm not a kid. I'm generation Z, not Zen, Zen Alpha. So, uh, but I'm afraid what quadrophobists are doing, like, right having animal ears and running on four legs <laughs> hands and feet on the ground so um so this is what they are planning they are planning to meet every wednesday every wednesday from 4 to 6 30 uh they will meet and that some uh, like uh, spinning, uh, like uh, spin <laughs> beach. That some beach uh, parking lot, and from there they will go to some place, some other place, and they are like. Uh, addressing the history that there is no fee for entry that is that is mad why, why would you even need fee for a entry on this kind of like they are not paying anything they are just outside and they want people to come outside and like pretend to be animals with them and like do like uh, uh, aerobics with them like uh, athletic stunts with four legs. Oh no. Uh, and like, uh, what is, uh, I don't understand all the terminology here. Uh, like, uh, they said that you need to have uh, your own, like, uh, lunch for the event and. Uh, and what they want is uh, like mask ears. They want people to have the cat ears or the dog ears. And this is all already like they are like um, pushing that uh, like um, how would you say? I, I guess these young persons already have like a dog or a cat that they think they are for reals and they are thinking that other people are like them they, they want to have a dog pack or a cat pack like uh, what if someone comes and says that I am I think I'm a whale what 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 you're gonna do then is the whale gonna go to the like water on the beach? Like, uh, 
this is this is making no sense. No, no child wants to become a whale or a dolphin. They are like two intelli- intelligent animals for them to comprehend. But a uh, uh, like a really cute puppy dog or a pussy cat is like a perfect. Uh, identity for me I, I can understand them perfectly even if they don't understand them at all people don't understand animals at all uh, and this, this is really I'm looking at them like uh, them like invitation they are given and and I don't just some terms that I don't understand and if I would tell you you wouldn't understand it because it's finished so um I I think they have mis like again misspelled a tail it can't be anything else I might be wrong but I might be right they want the peer persons attending to have the ears and uh, like uh, like tail like these people have already decided that every Terrian is uh, wanting to become a dog or a cat so childish how you don't know that this is this is idiotic and they are like um this is this is going like um really this is so young kids have rolled in this it's make it's not making sense like um I guess they have like tried to say okay they have tried to say that the uh, the ears and the tail is not mandatory okay and then they have like mentioned that the people like uh, running this uh, running this meeting are kids and they have like put when it starts and hope you can make it and then they have like uh, drawn a heart made some kind of like almost religious or occult uh, like picture guess some kind of Terrian logo or their own and like like um, Donna yeah it's Terrian logo since they have done it twice now and then they have like Paul drawn to their okay they have Twice they have like a rotten quadrophobist that would not, and they have like specified that this is not the like uh, ter. I think they're meaning like like this is not the furry meeting. Okay. So, oh my eyes, it's so annoying, I'm just so... So annoyed. Uh, why this is so annoying to me is, uh, like, when I was, uh, like, uh, on that shamanism mind state, like, my, um, I would... I would switch the like the spirit animal before I like wanted to be the king of the forest and uh, tattoo the bear and like to 
like sync it in now you're a bear you don't change it anymore but I changed the spirit animal many times I felt like I had like many times my uh, personality changed I was like uh, when I was still in school there was this um, uh, it's less Italian if it's same in English, English I think it is but uh, like Christian brands uh, I don't like the brands but uh, I was like uh, for my social and healthcare school so I, I went to uh, like to this family where like the father was working and mother was doing his uh, like some kind of graduation testing practicing for their dad so she didn't have time for the kids so I have to look after like two young kids and one baby so uh, eldest son of that family had like um, imaginary plane that he thought that he was a bear and always when he thought that he was a bear he would misbehave like the bear identity gave this extremely young boy like uh, he didn't act at, uh, that at, like that when he was not playing, but when he played, he was like extremely selfish, extremely annoying, and like like he would throw a pillow. I'm a bear, and he would be making that bear sound and throwing pillows off the sofa. And when you he would be outside, he bear he wouldn't play with his younger brother his younger brother would follow him around and like big brother big brother play with me and he would be like growling at him like he was so antisocial when he got that mood on and like when uh, we went to the um, uh, what it's called daycare center like daycare and there we are like he got the idea on the daycare that now I'm a bear and there was like some kid who wanted uh, like to have um, like to play with the um, toy that he had been playing and or was it few toys since the daycare uh, like worker said that um, like to the young boy that uh, who played the bear, bear and, that uh, since he was growling at this kid and didn't want to share that, like the bear doesn't need to share toys, so the daycare worker needed to say share toys with the kind. Uh, could you share toys with this other boy? But no, he was antisocial because he was thinking he's a bear and he's like the king of the like everywhere. So. If it uh, affects a grown man, if it affects uh, young, really young kids, if you're thinking you're some kind of animal and you give that animal characteristics, like we give them, like fox is sly and the snake is like wise and like fox is kind of like noble. Bear is strong and etc. Uh, etc. Et oh, and why it's so harmful now that I'm a Christian? So this is something that I usually don't want to talk about, like the matter of the Holy Spirit. So, like, what kind of anatomy I think I have is like uh, that I have like my body is um, like three parts I have a physical body I have my I have my soul and this is where 
animals are. They have b body, they have soul, but then there is the Holy Spirit. And I don't like to talk about this, since um, it's uh, kind of like um, if you are talking with non-Christian person, you are saying, I have something you don't have. If you are talking with the Christian person, you are saying, we have something that others don't have. And so what I like to do is, I like to keep this topic to myself and not talk about it. Well, of course, if you are in a Christian company, you can talk about, uh, like, Holy Spirit is important, like, say, uh, like that. You need to listen to Holy Spirit, not uh, like what's, what the Bible says all the time. You need a like, living relationship with the God. Like that kind of thing. But uh, it's, it's very, very, how would you say, it's serious topic. And, well, person who doesn't believe that he or she has a Holy Spirit doesn't have it, of course. That's just plain sense, common sense. But uh, if you think you're an animal, you are like uh, um, making life worse for yourself. You are not open for the Holy Spirit. If someone comes and claims that it's not good to have only soul and body and you are thinking that you are a dog then you are like less inclined to listen to that person you have chosen like um, you have chosen to become an atheist as you think you're an animal no animal believes in God we don't know what they think, but I bet they think about food and mating. And like keeping their territories. Yeah. So what also concerns me that this is like young kids wanting to gather around every week. Like um, at evening dress up as like some cute animal that has, has fluffy ears and like um tail fluffy tail and they want to run around on four legs and isn't this just an invitation for a pedophile? Pedophile with like a... Like um, What's it called? Well, it would be a spy class if we would have been pirate era, but... Uh, you know what I mean. Uh, well, a <laughs> telescope would be like if you're watching into space, but... Uh, well, let's say that um, a pedophile with a camera that has extremely good zoom or maybe some like uh, attachment to the camera that he can zoom really close from really far. These kids would never know that uh, there is a pedophile taking pictures when they are running on four legs dressed up as an animal like easy pickings well, why, why would uh, it's just common sense for parents to protect their children but uh, I, there, I think there is no mama bear in this household letting the kids think they are animals like Taking the full identity uh, crisis that the, the Satanists have brought upon the world, like uh, 
if my wa uh, like son wants to be a dog, he can be a dog. Like uh, in my fantasies, I am a pirate, and I will become the Christian king of the pirates. And Gen Alpha is thinking they are dogs and cats. Like your your fantasy is weak. You are weak. <laughs> and if I you are saying that you are a dog, then uh, and you are not gonna turn back to human. Then I will say that I have Holy Spirit, and you don't have Holy Spirit. What well, Jesus came to earth was to bring Holy Spirit to mankind. It said that uh, he says that he's not going to bring peace upon the world, but a sword. And when you look at uh, what is uh, uh, God's. Uh, armor in the armor of God in uh, Bible the word of God is God's word that is a spirit so this word that uh, Jesus died for to bring us is the Holy Spirit so I take it not for I don't take it for granted it was a gift of great sacrifice And I blame it on the Satanists who have messed up our youth's head that they are actually thinking that they are animals. Really young kids, why did you need to have to make this? You didn't need to like uh, make it popular for the kids to find their identity in something other than like... Uh, Jesus Christ in in spiritual matters that would be where I would advise to look for your identity God knows who you are and you know who you are deep inside and like uh, conversing with God can help you find who you are like Finland is not like gay phobic at all like uh, Christian church might be and the teachings of the Bible might be but who says that Bible is not modified over the time by Satan and Satan's uh, followers so uh, I don't have anything against gay people but I do have every bit of right to go against people who think they are animals. That's just bad. There is not, no hope for any spirituality in this practice. No room for growth. Can a dog grow beyond a dog? No. Can a person who thinks he's a dog go beyond that dog? No. They are not developing, they are like uh, doing the opposite. Going backwards. Okay, I think that's about it. Really, really sad. And if you have uh, something to say about this Terry and, and Quadrobis thing. If you have something to say about protecting children from pedophiles or from protecting from like harmful uh, beliefs, please comment. It would mean the world to me to be able to talk about this issue. And let's leave it at that. So, thank you for listening. And goodbye.